thanks to all the directives of the centers who have contributed for this mission in various ways, building the rocket, building the satellite, and also providing the ground infrastructure for us to operate and make this mission possible. So congratulations to all of you for your excellent contributions and all the team members of ISRO and also the partnering academy and institutions for making this mission possible. Now, all of you know that the mission was at a 650 kilometers, 6 degree inclination, and we could have done the POEM experiment in the same orbit. But as a responsible space agency, we decided to bring the fourth stage to a lower orbit so that its life of the stage in the orbit is much lesser so that we don't create uh, debris in that process. So that's why it has been brought down to 350 kilometers. And in that orbit, we will be carrying out the experiment with the payloads as already been mentioned. We have an interesting fuel cell experiment, which is going to be one of the precursors to our future powering of space station and other areas when we have to have uh, power generation on board. And the VSAT is the Women Engineered Satellite, which is going to be an excellent uh, uh, contribution from all the girl students who have uh, built this spacecraft. And we also have uh, the experiments uh, sponsored by various uh, non-governmental entities, space uh, startups in India, uh, powered through the in-space coordination process. So congratulations to InSpace for enabling all these payloads on board the PSLV. Uh, and we are going to have uh, uh, not only that, uh, that this poem is going to be unique in that expect that all these payloads are there, but we are also having a unique way of dumping the remaining fuel and propellant and gas in this stage with a different approach, which is again not, not going to be done for the very first time. And the entire platform of POEM is going to be stabilized using cold gas thrusters, which has, be, which has worked in the last time very well. So we are looking for the orbital change, which will happen by the two firing of the engines and also bringing to 350 kilometer circular orbit. And after that, the POEM experiment will start. And our expectation is the whole process of this testing will be over in very short time. And we'll be able to declare this POEM payload uh, successfully, maybe a course of one month or so. So possibly all of you know that the POEM payload has its own power generation capability with solar cells, batteries, and its own computers and commanding systems. So it's almost a full-fledged spacecraft supporting all of you to conduct experiments at very low cost. So it's again, once again, an invitation to all the startups, uh, budding and entrepreneurs, students across the country to come and host your payloads on board PSLV 4 stage for experimenting and trying out your new ideas. So with this, let me close today's mission uh, activities uh, from the control center of Sadir Savan Space Center. And we'll be back with announcements through our social media platforms for what happened in the poem and what type of results have come out. Wait for that. And this year just began, and we are going to have uh, many launches. And 2024 is going to be the year of Gaganyan. As you already know, the TVD1 mission has just been over last year, and this year we are expecting two more such test flights of the test vehicle, followed by the unmanned missions of the, uh, the Gaganyan pro program, and many more tests and, and experiments, which will be in number, very large numbers, which will not see, which will not be coordinated from this control center. Similarly, we are going to have missions of PSLV, GSLV, as well as SSLV in the coming year, uh, this year as well. So very hectic schedule waiting for all of you. And uh, once again, let me wish uh, a very, very happy new year, 2024, for the entire family of ISRO, uh, our partnering institutions, industries, and all our well-wishers. Thank you so much. Uh, goodbye.